All right, so grab a band if you have one. If not, that's okay. It's just gonna be added in on a couple of the stretches. So first, focus, forward fold. Feel that stretch come up the back of the legs. Hold it down there. Halfway lift it. Draw the shoulders back. Forward fold it all the way down. All the way up. Go into chair pose. Hold it. Take that chair pose straight into hinge forward, into forward fold. Let's do that again. Halfway lift. Forward fold. All the way up. Gentle back. Into chair pose. Sit it back in that chair. Into hinging forward. To forward fold. Walking it out. And pushing it back to downward dog. Come on down, all fours. Give me a cat. Into a cow. Into a cat. Roll those shoulders. Into a cow. Back up to that cat. And back down to that cow. Ah, take a seat. Oh, legs out in front. Okay. So, I'll do is the carpet for the heel. It's like the leg we're focusing on. So you can sit here, you can lean over it this way and get into it. Try to grab your toe, pull backwards, or you can grab a band if you need to or something that you can put around your foot too. And pull yourself down into it. Mm, come on up. Other foot. It's out there. Whew, sitting up tall again. Either grab it or wrap something around it and pull into it. Come on up. All right. To front. Same thing. You're going to either just fold down over it, just plop yourself down over it, or get something. It just gets it just affects a little bit different. Pull in and pull your body down. Come on up. Same thing now with that shoulder, with that arm thing. First, to me, twist. It just feels like my body wants a twist. It wants a twist. Yes. Ah, twist to the other side. Ah. So now, either just go like this and pat yourself on the back, or if you have a band, grab a hold of it. Come on back with the other one. Grab a hold of it with the other hand and really pull into that stretch. Sit up tall. Ah, release it. Other arm now, okay? So you're grabbing it. Coming on back, you're grabbing a hold of it. <laughs> and you're pulling into it. Ah, oh, that stretch really good. Or you're just pulling back just naturally and pulling into it, okay? Ah, oh, 
release. Shoulder down, cross, and I like to twist into it just a little bit. It kind of gets more of the shoulder even and the side. Hold it. Other side, down, hold down, twist into it. Come on back, hands behind you. Lift the chest up. Ah, oh. that's good. Stretch out the chest. Come on. Oh. All right, come in. Pull the feet in. Lean forward. Now, earlier we did the frog ah, sliders. This is actually kind of like a frog stretch. It gets the inner thighs really good. You gotta get that leg out there. All right, so in there, pull down on it. Ah, pull down on it, really good. Going out of my mat, here, that's fine, come on. Hold it. Oh, come on up. Oh, those legs stretched out really good. I feel really good now. Come on back up again. Pull back now to now our dog. Step it through and you're going to full stretch. Twist it up. Step on back. Step back, downward dog, and full stretch on the other side. Ah, come on back, down, sit, leg over, give me a twist. You know we're gonna get twisted. Kitty cat, you got hair everywhere. I got a mess to put from you. Other way. Forward, step it back, brush the puppy. Come on forward now, all the way down. Scarecrow right on, you roll it. Side. Body definitely will be thanking you for stretching it out, okay? You did full body work. I'm trying to do full body stretches, but I did emphasize a lot of the low body because of all the squats and stuff. Cobra. Give me one more Cobra. Really push up into it. Come on up onto all fours. Give me another cat. Really push into that cat. Pull down into that cow. Push up into that cat. Pull down into that cow. Curl those toes under. Come up. Down more dog. We're gonna go through the series to end up in, in um, child's pose and then we'll be done, okay? So after now we're done, you know what comes next. Come forward, lower to your elbows, dolphin. Mm. 
Come on, in, lower those knees, up on those hands, elongate it, back, up, legs go wider, child's pose. Ah, up we go. So we got tomorrow's another long, longer day. And then um, Saturday, I'm gonna back it down a little bit too. I right now I'm only planning on doing the push-ups and the squats on Saturday. We'll see if I added anything. Else. Oh, and the stretch, of course. We'll see if I add anything else to it than that. I haven't decided yet. I haven't decided if I'm just gonna get these squats and the push-ups in throughout the day or do them in the morning either. So on Saturday, I'm not quite sure yet which way I want to go with it. Sunday is just going to be the squats. Then next week, I'm going to be changing it up a little bit. I've been doing a lot of time on like this week. So next week, I'm going to have to shorten some of the workouts in. We're going to be doing going back to the daily focus. So like combining it all in like I did this week, which I actually enjoy. You have to tell me which way you like, which workouts you like, so I know which ones to kind of do too. So okay. do you like the full body, the mixtures, the randomness of it? Do you like to do stoop, solid focus? Do you like basic moves? What 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 do you like? Okay, so that'll be no. But anyways, um we got through next week I'll, I'll plan on something like that. And it's just gonna be it's gonna be getting in there and focusing on it, making the most out of time and seeing what we can do. It's gonna be one of those less is more weeks and we'll see what we can get in. Although those still will be like several components. It's just gonna be a little shorter on the time and the components for some, for some of the days. This one here is checked off. It is 